Glucosa Telefe. Bless. 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 You will shine like every day. Every day. Every day. You are protecting in every way. That's why I'm missing your bless. That's why I'm missing your bless. The unblessed. Better than the rest. Better, better, better. Whoa, whoa, yeah. We say you're blessed. Keeping it real. The unblessed. The unblessed. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. So I hope you are having a wonderful time. Just want to leave a word with you today. It says, there is nothing too hard for God. God has heard your prayers and you will get through every trial you are facing. I know the difficulties before you seem insurmountable. But the Bible says, I will lift up mine eyes onto the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. Read Psalms 121 verse 1 to 2. When it is a new day, it comes fresh. And so let's have fresh thoughts. Let's walk into each day with a new attitude, no matter what happened. Remember that God will not give us more than we can bear. When you feel dismay, just tell yourself that you're a royal priesthood. Tell yourself you're a chosen generation and whisper a prayer to Jesus because he will fix it for you. You know, temptations are often detours to realizing the promises of God. Whatever you need, God has already made provision for it because God loves us. Our desires can cause pain and heartache when we do not lean on the saving grace of Jesus to lead us to what God has promised. When we do it our way, we will never reap the bountiful rewards of God. Heal not to temptation and subdue the passions that burn inside of you. Look to Jesus, my friend, for comfort and healing, for he will carry you through. The Bible said, God is my refuge and strength and ever present help in times of trouble. I know you believe that. There is a river whose streams make glad the city of God, the only place where the Most High dwells. God is within her. She will not fail. God will help her at break of day. Can you stand in agreement with me today that God is an ever-present help? I know you can. No matter how difficult your burden seems right now, God has spared your life to see one more day, no matter what you are facing, right? We serve a God who is bigger than every problem, more powerful than every adversary, and whose grace is sufficient for all our needs. My friend, remember the God that you serve. He is not an ordinary God. He is an extraordinary God. He sits high and he looks low. He knows our thoughts. He knows everything that we need before we even take it to him. You know, God does not. He's not the God who will say, all right, I'm not going to help this situation. He normally has a answer for whatever prayer we take before him. So when it seems like all hope is lost, just turn to Jesus. Remember the God that we serve. Remember he's a king of king and he's a lord of lord. I know we're living in a time when things seems as if, you know, we cannot go through the financial burdens, the kids giving us problems. So many things are happening. You know, when COVID came about, a lot of us thought we would not make it. So many of our loved ones has passed away. But here we are today, giving thanks to God for another beautiful day, 
giving thanks because he has spared our lives. You know, he has put food on our table. Where would we be if it wasn't for the goodness of God? So continue to trust in God. Continue to believe in him. You know, when the situation seems like it is going to take charge of you, you know, this world is filled with temptation, but we can handle it because we cannot be tempted unless the Lord allows it. And he will never give us more than we can bear. You know, Paul sinks into you as, you know, as he faced with a lot of these temptations that we are facing today. Paul says, for I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus. And you can find that in Romans 8 verse 38. So like Paul, let us be persuaded. Let us keep us, you know, as steadfast, grounded in the Lord. You know, every battle is temporary. Even so every storm runs out of rain. You know, one of the most difficult things about trials and tribulations is that they can seem to go on forever. But if it's not one thing, it's another. But let me tell you, the word of God says, for everything there is a season, more than ever. Oh, glory to God. Have a wonderful time. I have seen God heal, deliver, save, and restore so many persons. So I know my God is still on the job. And that same God is at work in your life.